and I'll turn off the computer I'm going to use a 960 gig SanDisk SSD. Okay, I needed to use one of these precision screwdrivers because the screws are real small. And the SSD doesn't come with screws, but luckily I have screws left over from my motherboard. Okay, I'm having clearance issues with the screw heads. The thing won't fit in there, so I'm going to remove one screw and hopefully it'll slide in there. It should be okay with just three screws. And yes, I removed that one screw and it fit in there nice and snug. And the screws fit in the holes so it's not out of alignment. So we're good to go. And now I'll turn it on for the first time. Okay, nothing popped up. So I'll go down here and click Disk Management. And a dialog pops up. It says I must initialize the disk. It gives me a choice. And from what I've read, since this is under 2.2 gigabytes, I should go with MBR master boot record and when I open Windows Explorer the drive is there and I put in a little test folder and I was able to copy a file in there, so I'm good to go. Shows I have 894 gigabytes of free space. And since it came with a SanDisk SSD, the 256 gig, I figured I'd get the 960 gig SanDisk because of the SanDisk software program right here. So I can like check the status on the, each drive. And I also just created like a taskbar button. So when I click on it, it like opens up straight to the drive. Thanks for watching everybody.